What's going on guys, Brussball Productions here, back with an all new Mortal Kombat X video for you guys, and in today's video I've got some news on the Combat Pack 2, and also a discussion about the character release order for the Combat Pack 2 characters that I will get to later in the video. But first, let's talk about the news that we've got. Now this news is coming from Tyler Lansdowne, who is the community specialist of Netherrealm Studios, and he goes on Twitter and tweets, At ESL Mortal Kombat announced it tonight. There will be a combat cast at the ESL Finals on January 24th, showing off a KP2 character. Can't wait. So yes, you read it right, there will be a character reveal on January 24th in a form of a combat cast, and usually in the combat cast, they always show the character's variations, their fatalities, their x-rays, their brutalities, pretty much an overview of what the character is going to play like. Now it is unknown which character will be shown on that combat cast, but that's why I'm here to talk about it. So, I'm going to be talking about the possible Combat Pack 2 release order for the DLC characters. And this is all pure speculation. Nothing confirmed. So the first character I think will be released first is Leatherface. It only makes sense. He's Jason's counterpart. And Jason was the first character to be released in the Combat Pack 1. And it does, again, make sense for Leatherface to be released first in the Combat Pack 2. It's also a good way to advertise the Combat Pack 2, so people who want early access to Leatherface, if they're going to do that, they're going to have to buy the Combat Pack 2, so why not do it? The second character I think will be released in the Combat Pack 2 is Boraicho. It only makes sense because I feel like Boraicho is Tanya's counterpart. They're both from the 3D era. They're both classic Mortal Kombat characters. They're both veterans of the Combat Packs they were in. So everything looks like it's leaning towards Boraicho being the second to be released in the Combat Pack 2. And Tanya was the second to be released in the Combat Pack 1. So... I don't know guys, I'm just speculating, but I do have a strong belief that Boraicho will be the second character released in the Combat Pack 2. The third character I think will be released for the Combat Pack 2 is Alien. Now as you guys know, Predator was in the Combat Pack 1 and was the third character to be released from the Combat Pack 1. And for obvious, and I mean obvious reasons, Alien is pretty much Predator's counterpart. So I feel like this one is a very big given, but who knows? Alien could be the first one, the second one, the last one. Like I said, I'm just a speculator. I don't know anything, so we're just gonna have to wait and see. So the last character I think will be released for the Combat Pack 2 is Triborg. Now I feel like Triborg is the tremor of the Combat Pack 2 for obvious reasons, such as him being the new character of the Combat Pack 2. He is not a Mortal Kombat veteran. We have never seen his gameplay before. Although his variations will be Sector Cyrex and Cyber Smoke, we don't know if it's going to be copy and pasted from MK9. Maybe if it's some new moves installed into Sector or Cyrex or Cyber Smoke. We don't know. This is a new character in the Combat Pack 2, like I said previously. So we're just going to have to wait and see. And it was the same way with Tremor. He has never had a moveset before, and they finally gave a moveset of his own to Tremor in MKX. So there you guys have it. There is my predictions for the Combat Pack 2 character release order let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below do you guys agree with me do you guys disagree with me if so what order do you guys think the dlc characters will be released in anyways that's all i got for you guys today i am sorry for being late on reporting the news i was talking about uh in the beginning of this video i was actually taking finals i was studying for finals uh, i actually passed all of my finals with b's so back to making videos it's winter break so i'm ready to do some more videos and once again i apologize for being late on reporting the news if you guys enjoyed this video i would definitely appreciate a thumbs up and possibly subscribe to get all things mortal kombat x my twitter and social media links will be down in the description below but anyways let me know what you guys think my name is bro Spoil productions and i'm out for now